In recent years, it has been a common trend among some small towns in Canada, to give away lots of lands for free or at a relatively cheap cost. The whole idea behind the tactic is to help the diminishing towns get back on a track of growth, anyone is granted land for free, as long as they are willing to show up and tend to it. With a few extra conditions, of course. The strategy isn't anything new, the federal government actually executed a similar plan in the pre-1930s. It worked then, and it appears to still be working now. Just a few years after these ghost towns were put up for sale, they started to rapidly increase in population. Free is a word that should be taken loosely in this context, because as we all know, nothing is ever truly free. However, all the conditions that are put forth by each town are reasonable, and the deals themselves are practically stolen. Although there are no current updates on these locations, these eight Canadian towns may still be giving away land for free or for cheap. Mundare, Alberta The town council of Mundare decided to sell commercial lots in its downtown area for a loony each. This was intended to encourage individuals to set up their businesses in the town. The only requirement was that, the business owners would need to start construction within a year of the purchase date. So far, a children's daycare and a real estate office have been established. 2. Pipestone, Manitoba Plots of land in Pipestone averaged a sale price of $10 each. Within the past five years, the municipality was able to sell 24 lots within its four main towns. The conditions for these sales include the construction of a home, within a year and a $1,000 down payment, with $990 refunded after the home is completed. Other incentives include $6,000 for building a new home, $4,000 for buying an already existing home, and $32,000 for starting a business. 3. Scarth, Manitoba Scarth was once a thriving rural town within the Pipestone area, but it is now a ghost town that is looking to sell lots for $10 each. The council is only putting up a dozen lots for sale to gauge the demand. If the public shows interest, they will continue subdividing the area. 4. South Knowlesville, New Brunswick South Knowlesville barely existed, until it started giving away lots of land for free six years ago. After giving away five lots, the town now has a population of 25 people, and is looking to give away another eight. One condition for the sale is that the buyers commit to revitalizing their plots. 5. St. Louis de Blanford, Quebec St. Louis de Blanford is a town near Quebec City that has subdivided its area into 40 lots. Since 2013, they have been giving lots away to anyone who will commit to developing the land. The only conditions include a $1,000 down payment, that will be refunded after the buyer has successfully built a house worth at least $125,000. 6. Crike, Saskatchewan The town of Crike attempted to reverse its demise by selling vacant lots for $1. Anybody interested would have to submit an application, that discloses their plans to create an eco-friendly home. The town is now currently experiencing a rise in population. 7. Cooper, Saskatchewan Cooper has been offering $1 lots to the public since the early 90s, and there may still be some lots available for purchase. Free municipal taxes and water for a year would be included with the sale. 8. Crown Lands, Yukon
some vacant land is still available in the Northern Crown lands. The government is open to giving the land away to individuals who will commit to farming it. The one tricky requirement is that, you'd need to have been a resident of the Yukon for at least one year. If you meet this condition, you are free to fill out an agricultural land application. In this video, we discussed 8 Canadian towns where you could get land for free. If you got this video helpful, please give a thumbs up to the video. Don't forget to share this with your friends. Subscribe to the channel for more important videos like this. Thanks for watching.